before we get into the video, I'd like to ask you to please go and subscribe and hit the bell icon so that way you know when a new video is uploaded. If you'd like to support my channel, please go and see my merchandise store that has all kinds of new stuff being put on there daily. I also have an Instagram as well as a few other social media sites if you'd like to check out to see what else I am doing. And let's get into the video. For the past few years, a group of my friends have put on a rave that happens at the largest con in my city. Very nice enough to give me, the convention staff, my info when the staff asked around for con volunteers. This secured me a hotel room to stay at, as well as a weekend pass that allowed me to skip all lines. It was awesome. The only catch was that I had to work the information desk for about six hours each day. For me, this was no problem. I was actually kind of excited to be able to sit back and just watch the cosplayers, help people that needed help, and just talk to anime fans. I was honestly not expecting the actual storm that fell down on me and other volunteers from this one girl. Now she stormed, and I mean stormed, up to the info desk and loudly declared that she had misplaced her con pass. She demanded that we instantly give her a new one. Now this girl was dressed in probably the skimpiest outfit, barely even covering her body, and she was literally wearing a scarf as an outfit. In tow was what probably was her boyfriend, wearing some sort of Edward Elric cosplay and probably like the naughtiest wig I'd ever seen. Despite their appearance and her rude behavior, I sympathetically told her that I was sorry that she had lost it and all she had to do was give us $10 and we would give her another full weekend pass. A sweet deal considering the pass itself was at least 60 bucks. She freaked out. She had a full-on tantrum, screaming that she couldn't afford another $10, that she had already spent all her money, that she couldn't even have money for food, and I politely told her that once again, I was sorry, but those were the rules. She began to cry, and her boyfriend was really pissed. They yelled at us for a good five minutes about how we were ripping her off, and how we were horrible people. Then she stormed away, and I saw it. This girl's con pass was stuck to her exposed butt. After gaping at it for a good few seconds, unable to believe my eyes, I called after her and reported the current whereabouts of her pass. She looked at me, looked down at it, looked back up at me, and then let out a deafening scream. Her boyfriend shot me a dirty look and did this weird guffaw Thing, and then quickly ran after her. There were a few other jerks that insisted we just give them free pa new passes, but I think this girl really outdid them all. 